Hey friends, so today I have another book to read with you. It's definitely a favorite, I think, of everybody at school, and I know a lot of you have it at home too. It's definitely one of Simone's favorites. Nuffle Bunny! And this story takes place in Brooklyn, which is where all of you live as well. Let's see what happens. Not so long ago, before she could even speak words, Trixie went on an errand with her daddy. We see Trixie and her daddy, and their mommy sitting on their stoop in Brooklyn. Trixie and her daddy went down the block. Through the park. Past the school and into the laundromat. What do you do at the laundromat? Your laundry, you wash your clothes. Trixie helped her daddy put the laundry into the machine. Really, Trixie has pants on her head. Uh-oh, who's in the laundry basket? She even got to put the money into the machine. Then they left. Uh-oh, it's the Nuffle Bunny in the washer. But a block or so later, Trixie realized something. What do you think she remembered or realized that she didn't have somebody with her? Trixie turned to her daddy and said, Aggle, cobabble, cobabble. That's right, replied daddy. We're going home. Trixie's daddy can't understand her. Go flaggle kablabble, said Trixie again. She's getting frustrated that her daddy doesn't understand her. Flaggle plabble, wumble flappy. Snoop. She's feeling lots of different emotions. Worried, just a little scared. Now she's sad. No, please don't get fussy, said her daddy. Well, she had no choice. Wah! Trixie bawled. She went boneless. She did everything she could to show how unhappy she was. Because she can't use her words, she's trying to let her daddy know that she's very upset, but he can't understand. By the time they got home, her daddy was unhappy too. As soon as Trixie mommy, mo Trixie's mommy opened the door, she asked, Where's Nuffle Bunny? <gasps> so the daddy realized. Trixie does not look amused. The whole family ran down the block and they ran through the park. They zoomed past the school and into the laundromat. They ran so fast. Trixie's daddy looked for Nuffle Bunny and looked and looked and looked. But Nuffle Bunny was nowhere to be found. How does Trixie look here? Sad, right? So Trixie's daddy decided to look harder. Until Nuffle Bunny! I found Nuffle Bunny! And those 
were the first words Trixie ever said. The end. Thank you, friend.